I love the faith building offering. I love what it has done for First Baptist Church of Bridgeport. I love what it's done for our buildings, our facilities, for others we've been able to help. I love what it's done for our people. And I love what it's done for me. Faith building offering is exciting and it's scary. I remember one year, we'd been several years into the offering and every year I'd given a little bit more money than the year before. And I said to the Lord, I can't keep doing this. I'm going to soon be giving more money away than I make. You see, it's important to explain these things to the Lord because he would not know them otherwise. One Wednesday, I was teaching a Bible study and talking about trust and surrender. And while I was doing that, the Spirit of God said to me, can you trust me? I tried to explain to the Lord this was a lesson for the members of the church, but he kept asking me, can you trust me? And in that moment, I did the hardest thing, the most important thing and the sweetest thing that a Christian ever has to do. I surrendered. This offering is about you trusting God to do what he can provide for you to do, even if you don't see it ahead of time. It's interesting for my wife and I this year because we don't have the salary that we had. Our income is very uncertain and quite irregular. And we're going to trust God and give a generous gift to the faith building offering. I want to be part of this great church. I love what's going on. I want to feel like I'm invested in the progress that is being made, the souls that are being won and the growth that is being accomplished in the lives of so many people. And I'm also really excited about the sign. I love the design. I love the idea. I think it'll be a huge asset and a huge help to the ministry. So as you pray about what to give, it won't be hard to know what God wants you to give. It'll be hard to trust him to do what he says. But if you do, it'll be the sweetest thing, the most important thing and the hardest thing you'll ever do in your Christian life.